Today we'll be talking about a molecule that's been buzzing in the biohacking community, NAD+. I'll explain why biohackers love this molecule, its potential benefits for longevity, how you can get NAD therapy, and what the cost is going to be. So let's start with a story. Now imagine you've discovered a magical elixir that could slow down the aging process, improve cognitive function, aid in addiction recovery, enhance athletic performance, and even combat depression and anxiety. Sounds too good to be true, right? Now that's exactly what NAD Plus is touted to be in the biohacking world. So what is NAD Plus and how does it actually work? Well, NAD Plus is a coenzyme found in every cell in your body. They play a crucial role in metabolism, DNA repair, cell growth and survival. It's found in abundance in the mitochondria, the cell cytoplasm and nucleus, where it aids in critical functions like regulating cell growth, energy metabolism, stress resistance, inflammation, circadian rhythm, and a lot of neuronal function. Now, as we age, the levels of NAD plus in our bodies decline, and the average NAD concentration in human samples is several times lower in adults than in newborns. Now, this decline has been attributed to reduced synthesis and increased consumption of NAD plus. Now, reduced NAD plus levels are associated with a wide range of the hallmarks of aging, from wrinkles to metabolic disorders and neurodegenerative diseases. NAD plus also seems to have protective properties in the context of autoimmune disease. And this is seen in a study conducted by researchers at Harvard Medical School. They found that NAD plus could alter the immune response and reverse disease progression by restoring damaged tissue caused by autoimmunity. Now, it's important to note, however, that these studies are still in the early stages and a lot of further research is needed to fully understand the potential therapeutic use of NAD plus in autoimmune disease. Now, how do you actually boost those NAD levels up? What are some of your options? Now, there's a few ways to boost NAD plus levels in the body, but the most popular method is through supplementation. It's also the cheapest. Specifically, supplements containing NAD plus precursors like NMN, nicotinamide mononucleotide. These are often used, and these precursors are transformed into NAD plus within the body. However, very important to note that while promising, much of the research on NMN supplementation has been conducted in cell and animal models, and more human trials are definitely needed to fully understand understand these effects. Now, in a long-term study on mice, NMN treatments mitigated age-associated weight gain, enhanced energy metabolism, improved insulin sensitivity, and prevented age-linked changes in gene expression. It even showed potential in protecting neurons against neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and improved memory in animal models of the disease. But what about humans? A study at the Kyle University School of Medicine found that a single oral administration of NMN, about 100 to 500 mg, milligrams caused no significant adverse effects in 10 healthy Japanese men. Now let's talk about some other ways that you can get NAD into your body without supplementation. Now these are going to be a little bit more expensive and more prohibitive. First, the restoration of NAD levels in the body through NAD IV therapy has been used to optimize the body to better combat disease, slow down the aging process, and support critical body processes. This is where the potential benefits for longevity come in. Now, as we age, our bodies produce more free radicals that can accelerate the aging process. NAD IV infusion therapy has been shown to slow down and even reverse this process. NADH, a form of NAD, is a powerful anti antioxidant that can help neutralize those free radicals and protect the body against the decline of aging. Now, NAD IV therapy also protects against age-related neurodegenerative conditions by shielding neurons from damage. It aids the function of brain cells by helping them adapt to various stress levels, facilitating healthy brain aging, and improving cognitive function. Now, in neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's, where NAD levels are reduced, NAD infusion therapy helps slow down the progression of these conditions and improve neurodegenerative symptoms. Now, beyond these benefits, NAD IV therapy can also help with addiction recovery by detoxifying harmful effects of abused substances, preventing relapse by significantly reducing cravings and restoring body energy levels. Now, it can also enhance the functions of major organs in the body, like the liver and the heart, and boost renal and skeletal muscle functioning. Now, NAD IV therapy can manage chronic stress, improve athletic performance due to its energy boosting capability, boost immune response, response to inflammation and help combat depression and anxiety. Now let's talk about how you can actually get this therapy and what the cost is going to be. 
NAD therapy can be administered in various ways, such as NAD IV therapy and NAD injections, which is what I do. Typically, the duration for NAD intravenous infusion depends on the reason for the treatment and can last about two to 10 days. Now, in terms of cost, a single dose can cost up to $500 in cities like Los Angeles. However, the cost will vary depending on what they put into the drip. NAD intravenous infusions are generally safe and are not known to have any serious side effects. However, it is an invasive procedure that involves direct entry into the bloodstream, and that might come with the usual complications. Common side effects that are often experienced include nausea, abdominal cramping, and soreness over the injection site. And as with any medical procedure, it's important to consult with a healthcare professional before starting NAD therapy. Now, while the research and anecdotal evidence for NAD therapy are promising, it's important to approach it with a well-informed perspective and realistic expectations. Now, for what I do, my good friend, Dr. Jarrett, started using NAD injections about a year ago. He gets them shipped to his house from a compounding pharmacy, and he injects them right into his abdomen as a subcutaneous injection. I started doing this about a month ago and noticed immediately increased energy levels. Now, I have nothing to sell you here. I have no one to refer you to. This is something that you're going to have to work with your own physician to see if that's a good fit for you. Now, who's a good fit? Now, if you're over the age of 40, you're a good fit. If you're over the age of 30, and I've started to notice energy levels start to wane, you want to try the medication and see if you get an energy boost from it, it's likely not going to cause any damage, but it's important to work with your physician to see if that's an option for you. I personally am passionate about biohacking and keeping my body, my, my machine in tip top shape. So this is something that I will be doing likely for the rest of my life. As the technology progresses, I may change from the subcutaneous injections to infusions or to whatever comes next. Now, if you enjoyed this video, want to see more about biohacking, NAD, similar molecules and medications, be sure that you not only subscribe to the channel, but opt into my newsletter. There's a link down in the show notes. Just drop me your email and phone and I'll send you stuff that you will not be able to find on YouTube. Please like this so you see more of this in your feed and shoot me a comment if you have any questions about what was discussed here. Thank you. I'll see you in the next video.